Welcome everyone to Pennsylvania College of Technology, the home of hands-on learning. Located in beautiful central PA, this sprawling campus is situated in the town of Williamsport. Just minutes from historic downtown and only a few hours drive to major cities like Philadelphia and New York City. Here you'll find over 150 learning labs. And that's what makes Penn College so cool. Students spend some of their time in the classroom, but the majority of it will be in the labs using tools and equipment just like they'll find in the real world. So when it comes time to get to work, they're ready and employers are knocking down their doors. I'm your host, Alex Boylan, and over the next half hour, we'll see what it's like to be a Wildcat. And who better to tell us these stories than the students themselves? I know they can't wait to share their stories, and neither can I. Let's get to it. Welcome everyone to Penn College. This is the College Tour. All right, everyone, fasten your seatbelts. Here we have Drew. He's on the Penn College Baja team and a senior majoring in automotive technology management. Drew's gonna tell us how he found his way to Penn College and the lineup of supportive services that are here to help him and other students stay focused and on track. Take it away, Drew. Hey y'all, and thanks Alex. Growing up, I always wanted to work on cars. The dream is to open and run my own shop. When I heard about PCT's Accredited Automotive Management Program, I jumped at the opportunity. The 2 plus 2 program allowed me to get my associate's degree back home and transfer my credits to PCT to get my bachelor's degree. Being away from home was a huge change for me, and I spent a lot of time adjusting to being on campus. The staff and school has done a lot to make that transition easier, with the help through resources such as the LEAP Center. There, they assign counselors who will guide you through your first year. Because of the support from the college, a number of opportunities on campus opened up to me and I became more involved. My two biggest contributions here are my work in the tutoring center and my involvement in the Baja SAE Club as the treasurer. The Baja Club is an amazing organization on campus where students from different majors like manufacturing, automotive, and welding come together to accomplish something incredible. We design and manufacture a single-seater off-road buggy and race in an international competition sponsored by SAE. I'm in charge of making sure that the vehicle is ready for the races. This includes everything from ensuring that the vehicle will pass tech inspection, making sure the drivers have the proper safety gear, packing the necessary tools, and managing the pits during events and repairing the vehicle as needed. We compete against colleges from around the world. My experiences here at Penn College have helped me develop as an individual. The connections I've made and the opportunities I've had have helped me get one step closer to my end goal of owning a shop. Throwing it back to you, Alex. Oh man, wish I had Baja at my college. What a fantastic idea. Having students from different majors put their skills and minds together to achieve a common goal. Tearing around the track on race day sounds pretty fun too. Keep up the great work, Drew, and thanks again for sharing your story. It is my pleasure to introduce you to Ashley. She's a human services and restorative justice major with minors in psychology and criminal justice. Ashley didn't come to Penn College right after high school. Her path took some twists and turns, but she ended up exactly where she was meant to be. Ashley, the spotlight is on you. Take it away. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. Growing up in New York City with a single mom, college was actually not my first choice. When I stepped here on campus, I was here with my boyfriend, who was the one that was going to attend. But after I realized the school's values, the hands-on experience, and I met the staff here, I immediately fell in love and I had to apply. And now, I've actually been here for the last three years. The hands-on experience here at Penn College is like no other. What I learn in the classrooms, I get to apply to real-world situations through labs, internships, and leadership positions. Growing up, I was extremely introverted, but thanks to the inclusivity here, I have become tremendously involved on campus. I have held many leadership positions, including Vice President of Public Relations for the Student Government Association, 
a presidential student ambassador, and I'm also a mentor to those in my major. I also belong to many clubs and organizations here on campus, including THON, the One World Club, and the Human Services and Restorative Justice Club. Penn College hosts many activities throughout the whole year. You can attend events and lectures, art shows, outdoor festivities, and celebrations from various cultures. We have over 60 clubs and organizations here on campus, and if none of those catch your eye, you and 10 friends can start your own. Our hands-on culture here at Penn College allows us to get immersed in our field. So whether that's accounting and business, brewing or graphic designs, we get to do what we love. When I first started college many years ago, I was disappointed by the traditional way of learning and could have never imagined learning hands-on, not just in a classroom. Here, we're given access to the latest technology and are given the skills needed to achieve our goals and stand out. Now, throwing it back to you, Alex. Things have a way of working out. We're glad you found your way to Penn College, Ashley, and thanks for telling us about your journey and where you are today. Embracing change really paid off for you. Well done, Ashley. Okay, next up, this awesome student is gonna fill us in on what it's like to be a dental hygienist in training at Penn College. Dacia and her classmates get a chance to put their skills to work in the dental clinic that's located right here on campus. It's open to the community, including students who can get $5 cleanings. Tell us all about it, Dacia. I'm so happy to be here with you today. Thank you so much, Alex. When I was a little girl in Jamaica, dental care was expensive and hard to access. This motivated me to earn the best education so that I could help my community one day. Now I'm studying dental hygiene. The nursing and health sciences programs at Penn College are open to students at any phase of their journey, from transfers and adult learners to international students. Whether you are a nursing, physician assistant, paramedic, physical therapist, assisted student, our supportive teachers, campus resources, and state-of-the-art equipment will aid you in developing your knowledge and relevant skill set to prepare you for future employment. The Dental Hygiene Program is fortunate to have a community clinic service where we can gain real-world experience. On campus, we have a beautiful clinic that accepts people from all over for dental cleanings. On Sealand Saturdays, Penn College works with local dentists and hygienists to provide free dental services to dozens of children that come in. The safety of the patient and overall sanitation is extremely important. We have personal protective equipment that protects us and ensures the safety and comfort for all patients. Classes are challenging, but every teacher holds regular office hours for us to get help. At Penn College, I'm not only learning techniques for cleaning teeth and learning x-ray skills, but also how to make a change in the lives of every person we come across, which makes my NHS program unique. I'm enjoying my work while working towards my dreams. So Alex, it's been really amazing to be here with you today. Thank you so much for having me and learning about my story at Penn College. What's next? What an awesome story with all that passion and hands-on experience. It sounds like you're on your way to a rewarding career, Dacia. Thank you so much for sharing your story. Now let's see what Alejandro is up to. He's a senior pursuing his bachelor's in architecture, and he's gonna tell us about his journey to Penn College, what he loves most about the program and all the possibilities to explore post-graduation. Over to you, Alejandro. Hello, everyone. Thanks for the introduction, Alex. I'm glad to be here. When I was young, I was always a dreamer. I always wanted to create from music, origami, drawing and painting to landscapes and structures. My father was an influence on my path in pursuing architecture. But what really brought me here to Penn College was my brother Enzo. Walking into the architecture studios for the first time here at Penn College, I expected the whole major to be just hand drafting. It turns out the School of Engineering Technologies is the biggest one on campus. There are students working in handfuls of areas, from IT, electrical and automotive, to HVAC and industrial design. For me, it's not just about working digitally, it's about the hands-on experience. 
From making concept models to fully finished building models, we are applying what we know to the real world. In my classes, we are taught all kinds of residential working drawings to commercial working drawings, while incorporating design into the architecture. Our classes truly allow us to unleash our creativity. Architecture always keeps me busy. Finding solutions to problems with design and making them real is what we do. Also, it's such a diverse field, there's so many opportunities after graduation. This is a great episode we're building, Alex. What's next? Thank you, Alejandro. After hearing your story, there's no doubt that you found the right fit here at Penn College. I think you were born to be an architect. That problem solving and creative thinking is spot on. We wish you all the best and can't wait to see your imaginative building designs. Thanks again. There's more to choosing a college than finding the right major. You wanna know your investment will pay off. Here's Danielle, a junior majoring in construction management and minoring in business administration. She's gonna share how she found the total package right here at Penn College. Now that's what it's all about. Danielle, you're on. Thank you, Alex, for that introduction. When I was younger, I always had the encouragement of my family and the opportunity to help my parents around the house with projects here and there. By the time senior year of high school rolled around, I was looking for colleges that could offer me an education in what I love, construction. After meeting the faculty and students and feeling their passion for what they worked on, I knew that Penn College was the college for me. The hospitality is unmatched and the willingness of everybody to help you succeed is incredible. Penn College has so many great resources for current and incoming students. There are scholarship opportunities available and it's as easy as filling out one form. Career services here on campus helps to organize career fair pop-ups, bringing employers from all over to speak to the students. Opportunity is always awaiting. They also have other career resources available. From interview help and resume checks to business card development assistance. We are known for our hands-on education, both in and out of the classroom. You'll have every opportunity to attend lecture and complete labs, then turn around and go on field trips and experience your trade in a real life scenario. Personally, being in construction management, I have learned a new level of professionalism and communication skills. That's me, back to you, Alex. Thanks, Danielle. I love hearing stories like yours and how you knew from such a young age exactly what you wanted to do. Sounds like there's incredible support here at Penn College for students like you and for those who need a little more direction. Thanks again for sharing your story. Take care, Danielle. If you're in the military or a veteran, or if you're interested in Army ROTC, you'll definitely want to meet this amazing student, Jesse. He's the perfect example of commitment both to his major and to ROTC. 6 a.m. training sessions, labs, classes, clinicals. When does this guy sleep? Amazing. Jesse, you are on. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. I'm currently a nurse in training and a cadet in the Army ROTC program here at Penn College. In ROTC, we are often taught the importance of health for both ourselves and our soldiers. In nursing, we are taught how to be empathetic and professional. The Army's written set of values aligns with many of the attributes and competencies that I, as a nurse, must possess. I have quite a hectic schedule, but Penn College makes my life a little bit easier by providing me with excellent instructors and my favorite, the Madigan Library. If I'm not in the library studying, then I'm running on campus or completing a workout in the dorms. As a contracted cadet, my room and board is completely covered by the school. I also get paid $420 for every month that I am in school and an additional $600 for books and supplies every semester. We even have a house on campus just for ROTC cadets. And if you are a military or veteran student, we have a center here just for you. And the team here is really great and will help you take advantage of all possible benefits. And you really can't find this level of support at most colleges. 
My bachelor's in nursing and commissioning into the U.S. Army Reserves will open up many other opportunities for me, such as overseas deployments and travel options. I am very excited to see what the future holds for me, and I am so grateful to have attended Penn College. What's next for us, Alex? Now that's commitment. Thanks for sharing your story with us, Jesse. I can see why you love nursing and ROTC. They complement each other so well. And with a dedicated veterans and military center, it sounds like the college fully supports service members. Great stuff. Thanks so much, Jesse. Penn College offers quite a few specialized programs. But unlike other technical colleges, Wildcats get the full college experience here. That's good news for students like Maggie, who's working towards her bachelor's in HVAC design technology and playing third base on the women's softball team. You're gonna love her energy. Maggie, please take it away. Thanks, Alex, and howdy, everyone. As a kid, I loved getting my hands into a project and creating my own work. When it came time for me to choose my next step in education, I knew that Penn College would be the perfect choice for me. With small class sizes and hands-on learning, I've been on the Dean's List my entire college career with the bragging rights of being a 4.0 student. And on top of this, I'm also the starting third baseman for the softball team here. This means I travel a lot. Luckily for me, my coaches and my professors are very understanding of my busy schedule. In the end, PCT helps me to succeed as a student athlete. By giving me a campus that is equipped with an amazing HVAC lab and a flexible athletic department, I'm able to take control of my future. Being a student athlete really gives me a sense of community here on campus. When I'm not in the library studying with my fellow classmates, I'm with my team, sled riding, going to get a meal, and making memories off of the softball field. Well, you don't have to be a part of NCAA to feel a part of the community. Here at Penn College, we also offer various intramurals like Ultimate Frisbee, 3v3 basketball clubs, and many more. Being a Wildcat has really shown me what it means to get the full college experience. Since being here, I've made connections in and out of the classroom that I will forever cherish. When you're with your fellow classmates studying for hours for one exam in the library, or you're on the softball field perfecting your game with your teammates, you tend to make bonds that last forever. My advice to you, come to campus, get involved, and stay wild with us. Go Wildcats, Alex, take us back. Wow, thanks Maggie, you really can do it all here. It sounds like the relationships you're building and experiences you're having in your classes and on the field are a winning combination. Being part of a strong community is always a great foundation for success. Great work, Maggie, take care. Okay everyone, let's catch up with Kayla. She's a senior majoring in business administration. When she first came to Penn College, Kayla wasn't the most outgoing person. When you hear her story, I think you'll agree she's really found her groove here at Penn College. Kayla, it's all yours. Hi everyone, and thanks Alex. When deciding where I wanted to start my college journey, the most important thing that I held on to was finding somewhere that I could feel welcomed and comfortable while also receiving hands-on experience. Penn College made me feel right at home the moment I came to visit and I just knew I had to attend. I truly appreciate how the Penn College community has brought me out of my shell and allowed me to embrace who I've always wanted to be. When I first started at Penn College, I was nervous to get involved. Luckily, I made the choice to reach out and join the Wildcat Events Board, the student-run programming organization. From there, my involvement snowballed. I've had the opportunity to lead in several organizations, and I have grown into a strong and outgoing leader and role model. I'm currently the Chair of Web, a resident assistant, and a lead connections link. I've also greatly enjoyed fun events on campus such as Hot Dog You're Here and Goat Yoga. But nothing has been more special than the opportunity to speak at the Convocation Ceremony. All in all, Penn College offers a wide variety of options for students to get involved, from all the student organizations to the leadership opportunities, and let's not forget all the exciting events constantly happening on campus. 
Penn College strives to provide a student-centered, holistic collegiate experience for all students, whether you are on campus, off campus, or a commuter student. Thanks to my experiences and involvement here at Penn College, I am thrilled to say that I've made the choice to change my career path to higher education. I have been extremely fortunate to have met many mentors here, and my only hope is that I can take on that same role with students in the near future. Well, that's all for me, Alex. I gotta head over and see the goats. What's next from you? Thanks for sharing your story, Kayla. Goat yoga, that's a new one. Your involvement across campus is truly inspiring. I can't believe you're doing all that while earning two minors. It's remarkable, and rumor has it you already have a job lined up and you haven't even graduated. Unbelievable. Kudos to you, Kayla. Choosing a college can be like finding a second home. It's essential to plant yourself in a community where you can learn and grow. Meet Wes. He's a senior in the Engineering Design Technology Program. He's going to tell us how he latched on to the maker culture here at Penn College and why immersive learning was a perfect fit for him. Thanks, Alex. Hi, everyone. I've loved working with my hands and building race cars ever since I was a little kid. And when I heard about Penn College, I knew I had to come check it out. One of my favorite things about Penn College is the teaching style. On the very first day of classes, we begin applying what we learn in the classroom to the lab. On average, we have three lab hours to one lecture hour. Penn College has some very generous corporate partners and donors that supply our students with amazing equipment to learn on. We also get to connect to our professors on a personal level. They have real world experience to help start us on our paths to our dream career. We have an electrifying culture here that is centered on making cool projects that I'm honored to be a part of. Dr. Welch's workshop is the place I like to go to work on both class and personal projects. I've used the machines in the makerspace to build my battle bots for our sword club. We build metal and plastic bots that we compete on campus with. This experience has really helped me bring my degree full circle by designing, building, and competing with my bot. Being a part of this community allowed me to grow in more ways than one. I have made many friends here that share the same passion of working with their hands from cleaning teeth to fixing cars. Penn College is a very hands-on school, and that's why I fell in love with it here. Well, that's my story. Back to you, Alex. Thank you, Wes. I love how you surround yourself with others who get you and how you all enjoy putting your stamp on your personal creations, like the BattleBots. I'm sure putting those skills to work on a real life project brings your lab work full circle. May the best bot win. Thanks again. College isn't just about labs and lessons. You have to live a little, right? Of course. Catherine, a physician assistant studies major, is gonna tell us why she chose Penn College and what she does in her free time. By the sounds of it, Williamsport is a mecca for outdoor enthusiasts. Take it away, Catherine. Thanks for the intro, Alex. Hey everybody, when searching for a college, I was looking for small class sizes, a school with a history of academic success, and a cross country team. Penn College was the perfect place with a physician assistant program and ability to run collegiately. As a local, I already knew some of the great things the Williamsport area has to offer, which was exciting to share with friends who weren't from around here. Penn College is near downtown Williamsport, which has unique local shops, restaurants, and fun things to do like the Hatchet House. Not only do you get the taste of a small city feel here, but there are also so many outdoor activities. There are a multitude of close trails for hiking and biking, and creeks to kayak and fish. The Susquehanna River Walk is one of my favorite places where I can get out and enjoy the scenery. One of my favorite places on campus is the Madigan Library. It has an art gallery, career center, a virtual reality studio, and a cafe where you can grab coffee and snack and head outside to study on the lawn. A nice thing about Penn College is its close proximity to major East Coast cities like Pittsburgh, Philadelphia, New York City, DC, and the beaches in South Jersey, which are my favorite. Aside from Penn College's main campus, we also have an aviation center and earth science center, both a short drive from main campus. These locations provide students with exceptional hands-on experiences in their majors. The atmosphere at Penn College is so welcoming, which has really fostered my academic success. Penn College has given me a well-rounded education 
through the opportunity to collaborate with others, practice necessary skills to become a PA, and make lifelong friendships. Throwing it back to you, Alex. Awesome, thank you, Catherine. It sounds like there is something for everyone here in Williamsport. I can't wait to hit downtown for dinner. You'll have to let me know where that hatchet house is. That's something I could get into. Cheers, Catherine. How about this place, everyone? Seriously, there's so much to love here. There's a term they've coined here at Penn College. They call themselves tomorrow makers. Now that I've met these incredible group of students, heard their stories, and I've gotten a glimpse of their talent for building, creating, designing, and dreaming. I'm a fan. This is the next generation of learning. It's hands-on training for in-demand careers from nursing and IT to welding and business. But don't take my word for it. Come here and visit this campus for yourself. There's so much more to see here. That's all the time we have for today. Take care, everyone.